Lieutenant General Thomas P. Bostick, Chief of Engineers and Commanding General of the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, visited Zama American Middle School to meet and talk with students who belong to the science, technology, engineering, and mathematics program known as STEM. Well, the purpose for our visit to the middle school here is to give an opportunity to the youngsters to learn more about science, technology, engineering, and math. Uh, what we did a couple of years ago is to sign a memorandum of understanding with uh, DODEA uh, that indicated that the Corps of Engineers would work with DODEA to help volunteer and support engineering classes in the middle school. So we're doing that all over the country and the world to help our youngsters learn more about science, technology, engineering, and math. Lieutenant General Bostick explained to the students how he got involved with engineering and addressed the importance of studying in the STEM field. He also opened the class for questions. The questions that they're asking uh, are, are very um, interesting and very uh, educational type questions and demonstrate that they are some of the best of the best students that I've certainly met and they're getting a wonderful education overseas. I kind of felt like special because he said that only one out of nine, we were only, we were one, of, one out of nine schools to be interviewed and considering the fact that there are like many schools in the world, that's a real great honor and I'm glad that like he flew all the way from Washington just to meet us. That was pretty cool. It was very educational. He taught me a lot through STEM and how he told us that first you may not know what you want to do in high school and you may not want to not know what you want to do later on in life but if you follow the path you'll get you'll surely get to where you want to go in STEM and you can learn a lot from it and build in, on your education and your learning abilities. Before departing Lieutenant General Bostick had one more message for the young engineers. The main message is just awareness. Um, our concern is that the country will continue to require uh, young um, men and women to study in the STEM field and it's awareness of that requirement so for example I told them in 2018 we'll need a million more STEM graduates just to meet the requirements that uh, we have in our country and that will take uh, individuals at a very young age keeping the doors open to studying science and engineering and math the STEM program has been taking place at Zama American Middle School for a couple of years with support of volunteers from the Japan Engineer District to create an environment that fosters young engineers. Reporting for U.S. Army Garrison Japan, I'm Kevin Kreitzark.